Minimax has just launched a new version of its software and it's really good. I was given access to it, so this isn't a paid promotion, but they have given me plenty of access to it. I wanted to see how it handled emotions. As a narrative filmmaker, emotions are incredibly important and AI tools are notoriously terrible at handling human emotions. Why? Because it's all head and no heart. It doesn't understand humans. So I thought, let's try 10 different emotions, some fairly obvious ones and then some subtle ones and a curveball right at the end. And I ran it across four tools, compared it to Runway, uh, Kling, Vidu, and of course Minimax. So the first thing I did with Minimax was run a couple of tests for the emotion of angry and flirting. And I tried it with the four different versions of Minimax that you have. Like there's the original version and then the new live version. And both of them have the option to press the little toggle box for um, optimization. I think it's prompt optimization, but I could never find the optimized prompt. Maybe I wasn't looking hard enough, but I thought, let's see what it looks like. So kicking off here, we've got <laughs> the angry test. Uh, you've got the prompt there and that's with uh, so it's working upwards from the original version with no optimization, then optimization, then the new version live without optimization, and then the optimized version. And um, I have to say, I, I think I preferred the optimized live version. So I thought, let's try another one. And this time flirting. And flirting looks like this. Um, it already looks impressive, to be honest. I like it already. But I wanted her swirling her hair around in her finger, which is in the prompt. And it wasn't until we got to the live version and especially with, op with optimization, that's when it started to get really nice. Now this one I really like. So having established that the live version with optimization is probably the best blend, I thought, let's try the rest of these tests. So I've got 10 examples of 10 emotions and it was the same prompt with only the emotion that changed more or less. So kicking off with angry, uh, runway, runway consistently across the board gave, uh, gave really nice results. Cling, well, you can kind of see for yourself. Video gets even more intense and Minimax, I think, is my favorite. Um, I've ordered these in, to be honest, consistently across the board. Um, runway was the one that was the most sedate, uh, like having an actress who can't act very well or she doesn't have a particularly broad emotional range to, to to draw from for her performances. So most of Runway's performances looked very, very similar. Um, Kling was a bit all over the place, but it much better than Runway in terms of the emotion there. Vidu I liked a lot, um, but Minimax was my favourite. This is kind of cutting to the chase. So let's go and look at Flirting and Runway. I mean, it's not looking bad. Kling, she's really starting to get in there. She's she's giving it some some eyes, and then video starts to look more natural. And Minimax, I included this one from this test and the one at the beginning, because both of them looked really really nice. I could have used either one of these in a project. There is a consistent. The thing that I've looked for across the board is two things: is how well the model really embodies that emotion and does it look human and authentic? So, for example, Kling, you'll see, has lots of intense emotions, but it doesn't look particularly human and authentic. Vidu, much more so, and Minimax seems to be the one that nails it. Moving on to Frightened, let's look at this. And so what you've got here is, um, I mean, Kling is just getting, this is where you lose the humanity with this weird mouth. Um, video, we've got a new guy in there. <laughs> and then Minimax, she's really looking frightened. Now you could argue that the performance is perhaps too intense. You know what would be great? A dial to kind of to crank up the emotion and dial it down. That would be really, really cool. But it, even so, consistently, um, I think I'd use Video and Minimax. Minimax being my favorite. Uh, let's look at the next one. Okay, now nervous, something a bit more subtle. Uh, how well does somebody look anxious and apprehensive? And they all did okay with this. Video, she's got something in her teeth. <laughs> Minimax, 
doing better. All of them in one way or another did okay with Nervous, I think. But again, I would probably lean in the direction of Vidu and then Minimax being the, my go-to. Um, I, I, Minimax seems to be authentically human in the movements. Shocked now. Runway, she doesn't look particularly shocked. Here we go, Kling looking a lot more shocked. Um, and then Vidu really looking shocked and at least looking more human than Kling. Minimax is just really going for it. <laughs> Bear in mind that you typically have to re-roll anyway. These were all first time in almost all cases. So if I were to re-roll, I could get improved performances and then start tweaking. But this is like a base performance. And um, all in all, okay. But certainly Video and Minimax, my favorites. Next one, Heartbroken. This is the woman she's heartbroken about. <laughs> Maybe he cheated on, well, I don't know. But then Kling, we're looking really heartbroken. And Vidu, this is looking more human and authentic. Uh, no tears from anybody, but certainly a woman who looks like she's about to break in tears. It's just the tears are just the one thing that's missing. But Minimax, again, is the one that seems to be the m most authentic. And Vidu, a close second. All right, next one is Irritated. Because it's a more subtle one. Runway, is she irritated? A little bit. Kling, a little more irritated. Here we go, yep, yeah, yeah. But her face is doing weird things. Vidu, more irritated and starting to get cross. Minimax, she's starting to get just a bit more angry. So, all in all, it's usable. All in all, I could redial and dial it down a little bit um, and try a different prompt. Let's look at test eight, puzzled. It's another subtle one. Uh, runway looking okay. Now that's, she's got some puzzlement on her face from Kling. Vidu, <laughs> I'm not sure. Minimax I like, Minimax I like the best from those four, if you put them together. If you were saying who looks puzzled, um, some looking weird. Others looking just, it's not there. Minimax is probably the closest performance that looks like. Next one if is uh, test nine, find the intrigued. And intrigued, again, I'm looking for subtle emotions here. Um, cling, is, I don't know, I, I'm not sure what I was expecting, to be honest, but I wanted to see how they'd handle it. I think Minimax is the one that comes closest if I was, yeah, that's the conversation that looks like there could be something that she's curious and intrigued about. I really like that. Okay, the final test was the curveball. This is where I tried to switch emotions. With all of them, by the way, the opening shot has her kind of looking a bit concerned with the furrowed brow and then it moves into something else. So there's already a transition from a concerned emotion to uh, whatever the other one is. But this final one, I thought, let's see how it is if we have a more extensive prompt. We're transitioning from happy and cheerful to something dawning on her that something isn't right. You know, it's like, I'm happy, but then hang on. He just said something that has thrown me and I'm like, hang on a minute. But didn't you just say that blah, 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 whatever. And I think that again, Minimax, I like the one that that delivered most, but video also right at the end, it had just that final moment of her just looking a little concerned and something's not right. All in all, really, really impressive. But Minimax is the go-to for emotional content. The one thing I would love to see would be to be able to type words into a prompt and then they mouth those words. That would be amazing. That would be amazing. Nobody's doing that yet. That would be amazing.